In California, the United States, boxes of medical masks going to West Africa to help fight Ebola must be first properly labeled. They are among the first batch of medical supplies that U.S. city volunteers are shipping out to battle the outbreak. We have a total of 31 volunteers here today. To be able to contribute ourselves to help battle the Ebola outbreak is wonderful. We are very grateful for this rare opportunity. It's the fruit of everyone's hard work. The Ebola outbreak began in several Western African countries at the end of 2013. To help Sierra Leone, the Healy Foundation of the U.S. signed an MOU with the Tsuji Foundation in Taiwan earlier this month. I think the biggest thing that connects us is the intrinsic compassion and goodness that both of our foundations feel exist in every person. And the fact that every human being has a certain dignity that they're deserving of, regardless of background, uh, race, or, or place. A week after the MOU was signed, Tsuji volunteers in the U.S. immediately began to ready the supplies. In total, nearly 690,000 medical masks, 700 stethoscopes, a medical bed and some 1,000 pieces of women's garments will be shipped to West Africa inside a 20-foot container. Uh, the, the kind heart of Master Chen Yang, this is wonderful, this will actually save lives. We have PPEs, as I said, gloves, masks, you know, um, even uh, um, a hospital bed here, and many uh, wares um, for, for hospital patients, especially for women. So we are very grateful, I am very grateful. As the Ebola Relief Special Project Director, Stefan, who comes from Sierra Leone, is helping out with the packing personally. Hopefully, working together, the two foundations can do much to help contain the outbreak.